Hello everyone, welcome back to Good Show Tips and in this video we are going to talk about how to fix Assassin Creed Mirage is having a resolution or full screen issue which is happening for many of the users and how we can fix this up so let's dive into the workaround. So when we are trying to launch many users end up in having this so if that is the case we will be letting you know how to fix this up. The first one, we need to change the resolution in acmirage.ine file and we have to change the windowed mode to 0, 1, 2, etc. So I'll be showing you. So what you need to do is we just need to go over here, not this one, sorry. Just go over here in the file explorer. Now from here go to this PC. Now from here go to documents. Now from here we have to go to assassin creed mirage, just open this. And this is the folder, so right click and we have to go for open with, go for notepad. The first one, we have to change the resolution. Right now, as you can see, the full screen width is uh, 1280 and the full screen uh, over here is uh, 720, that is what it is given. At the same time, if you scroll down, you'll be able to find, keep scrolling down, somewhere else you'll be also able to find windowed mode. So keep scrolling a little bit up. Over here you can see windowed mode. So as you can see the windowed mode is set into 2. That is why which is happening. So the full screen. The first one you can either set this to according to your PC's configuration. So I'll keep this to 1, 2, 1, 9, 2, 0, which is uh, my system's configuration. And the height should be 1080. So I'm giving the 1080. So you can give the value according to your uh, system's configuration. So mine is full screen width. I changed this to 1920 and the full screen height is 10080. And once after this, you just need to save this. Once you want to save this, we just need to go over here, right click. We have to go to show more options, go to the properties. Make sure this is read only memory and go for apply and go for okay. Once afterwards, we just need to check and also make sure we have to do the same. Just select the folder, go over here, open with, go to notepad. Now from here, 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 we have to change this one to windowed mode should be changed. So uh, we need to go over here. Now the windowed mode is 2. So you have to give the value either 0 or you have to give the value either 1 and you have to go for 2. So give each value, save it. And once you save the value, you need to go over here, save it, give the value one by one. Once you save the value, just right click and we have to go to show more options, properties. We have to go over here and make sure the read only memory has to be selected. Once afterwards, just close this and we have to go back and check whether the issue is solved or not. Next one, we need to launch the game and we have to start make a few changes in the game. So I'll be do one thing. Let me mute the volume first or else I'll be having the copy uh, right issue. So let me go over here and let me open the game. Once the game is successfully launched, I'll be showing you what we have to do inside the game. So actually we are doing a few changes inside the game. So I'll be showing you what we need to do. So uh, once you get into this, just go for next, next. So this is how the games looks like. So first one, what we need to do is once you launch the game, we have to go over here in the options. Now from here in the option, we have to go over here in the screen. 
and over here as you can see on the active monitor this has been set into primary so you can see there are uh, primary as well as this one so let me keep this to second one which is the primary i'm keeping this to second one and once you set this to second one from the primary go for apply and you have to go for yes and once afterwards just uh, quit the game you can quit the game and once afterwards just launch the game once again and see whether the issue is solved or not so this even work it so why we are quitting is because we wanted to save the changes once or afterwards try launch the game once again and that will be working fine next one is all about we have to verify the game file so just go over here in the big games launcher click on this three dot menu before manage there is an option called verify just click on this one and once afterwards you know uh, this will cross check every single files of a game and if any files are corrupted and if any files are missing and all these kind of issues will be fixed so this is a very important step next one is all about we have to install or update the graphics card so i'll be providing a link in the description to both nvidia as well as the amd the nvidia users have to go over here select everything like your product type product series product operating system etc should be selected so I'm on Windows 11, so I have to select this one, select every details and go for start search. Now from here, we have to keep scrolling down and we have to go over here in the 537.42 is the latest driver version. So we just need to download this, install, restart is a mandatory and try launch the game. So if you're on the AMD, just go over here, select every details over here and go for submit. And from here, we just need to, if you're on Windows 11, download this one. If you're on Windows 10, we can download this one install restart is a mandatory and try launch the game that is what we have to do next one we need to run the game on dedicated graphics card so just go over here in the search we have to search for graphics settings like this open this now from here we have to uh, go to the browse and we have to add the game so let me go over here in this pc now we can go to c and from here we can uh, search for the game maybe it is an epic game so just open this uh, maybe over here we'll be able to find it. So let me do one thing. Uh, I don't know what is the actual file. So I'll do one thing. Go to this three dot menu. Go to manage. Click on the install. So that is uh, local to C program file Epic Games Assassin Creed Mirage. Okay. So let's let me do one thing. Just go over here. Click on the browse. Local disk C program file x86 Epic Games. Not this one, I think. This is program file. Epic Games, Assassin Creed Mirage. Select this one and add it. So once you add it, this is how it looks like. Now change the option to high performance. It should be changed to high performance. Go for save. Now close this. And once afterwards, go back and try launch the game. Next one is all about what we need to do is we just need to rename Assassin Creed Mirage folder. So just go over here in the file explorer. Go to this PC over here. Now go to the documents. Now over here, just rename this particular folder. Just go over here, rename it, and you can give Assassin Creed Mirage dot old, or you can give dot new. Anything is fine. Just rename it. Once afterwards, try. Next one is all about. We have to do the same. Navigate to the documents. Delete this respective folder. When you do this, you have to keep in mind you will be losing all the progressions of the game, but that is fine. Just do this, and once afterwards, most probably the issue will be completely fixed. And I hope this video is helpful and if you find this video helpful, don't forget to subscribe and click on the bell icon for more notification. See you soon in the next video. Peace out. Bye bye.